Hi, and thanks for choosing to watch this C-Logic video on finding data within Sage CRM. Finding data within Sage CRM is very straightforward, and you can perform simple lookups of singular fields or combinations of data, or build more complex groups. We'll just look at the simple lookups at the moment. To find data, you right-click on the Find button, and we'll do a lookup simply on a company. We want to find our company called Gatecom Inc., so we simply type the first few letters of the name in the company name field. We then click Find, and records beginning with Gate are returned. We can now click and view Gatecom Inc. as required. We can also look up on combinations of field within the lookup screen. So let's say we want to look up companies of type customer in the City of London. First we clear our filters and then we select customer from the type field and type in London in the city field. Upon clicking find we see that we are returned 56 companies over six pages of data. I can scroll through the pages or go to a particular page I want to see and then select the record I'd want to view. I can also save my search so I can use it in the future. I simply click on the new search icon and type in a name for my search. Having clicked save, my search is now available in my drop down list under the company search screen. I can also carry out other searches within the other entities and the search screens are very similar. Let's look up opportunities that are open in the negotiating stage. I'm returned 26 opportunities over three pages. We can also look up data within records, in other words using filters. So let's look at our recent company Gatecom and go to the communications tab where we will see a good number of records. On the right hand side we have filters and we can see that we were, see that we're viewing all pending actions. If I simply want to look at phone calls out, I select phone out in the actions and apply the filter. This filters my list of data. Well that's about it. Looking up data in Sage CRM is very straightforward. Always remember to check the help files, but in the meantime, thanks for watching this C-Logic production. <laughs>